Now, new developments in a Target 12 investigators exclusive. A Providence police officer sued in an abuse of power case. Patrolman Robert Kells is accused of assaulting and threatening a man he thought had molested two children. Today, the jury found him liable of assault and battery, awarding thousands of dollars to the plaintiff. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau has the details live outside Superior Court in Providence. $17,000 in punitive damages awarded to Ricardo Tavares, who tells us today that he still does not feel completely cleared of the allegations that prompted the initial confrontation. Before Providence police officer Robert Kells <laughs> grabbed and shook Ricardo Tavares in Pawtucket, Tavares was accused of sexual assault. After Kells was found liable for assault and battery, Tavares told us being suspected of child abuse is sometimes like a conviction. It was all lies. If uh, you have the DCYF investigating you, that's what they're good for, and nothing was found, they probably should investigate the counselor. Kells accepted the verdict. I'll take my punishment and move on. But along with his attorney, Kells continued to claim that grabbing and shaking Tavares was about the two alleged victims. My lack of professional that evening was compromised by two little girls. And I did what I did for the kids. If Officer Kells' actions prevented further harm to those kids, it's not a bad price to pay. I think that's uh bogus and no excuse whatsoever. You never did anything wrong? No, sir, I haven't. Until this day, I'm still behind that kid's 100%. Officer Kells was cleared of false imprisonment and inflicting emotional distress. Tavares has still not decided whether or not he will appeal. Live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom for the Target 12 Investigators, Walt Guto, Eyewitness News.